good morning everyone welcome to the vlog if you're new here my name is melanie welcome to mellow lavender if you're not new here hello my lovelies i'm happy to see you back so today is going to be very interesting because i want to do a couple of things i want to vlog i also want to do a tiktok i also want to look at my investments i did a little makeup to feel a little bit more prepared and i want to apply to some jobs those are kind of like the biggest things for me and then i'm also going to work out and eat healthy and eat more consciously healthy so that's been a huge thing for me this year so i've been really meaning to work on my health and that's kind of one of the things that I really want to work on it and in 2021 i'm still quarantining i have legitimately two days left so yeah I don't know if anyone else has this issue, but Bath and Body Works, their candles never burn all the way through. And this one has been a real champ, and I just wanted to say thank you to it. So I just wanted to show you guys, I got these pillows from Brooklinen's as a gift for Christmas. And they are amazing. Like, best pillows, 10 out of 10. <laughs> you fluff them up, and they come right up. Quality, people. Quality. I super duper love these, and I wish I could have gotten more, but they're kind of on the pricier side so i would say just be aware of that i actually got them on a sale so they were originally i think 70 bucks i got them for 55 and i got the mid plush down pillows if anyone is wondering and these are like in between the plush and the fur <laughs> super excited to open it up and see what's inside so i just wanted to show you guys i got this crispy chickpea i don't know how to pronounce that bowl i got the creamy dreamy mushroom of a top and then i got sizzling hoisin shrimp and yeah super excited for these so i'm making some rice and the shrimp and then i am making some green beans here and again, I'm just making this recipe. And it was actually super easy. Um, I thought it was going to be much harder because I never dealt with ginger, but it was pretty easy. So I just made the food and I just added some carrots and some sesame seeds. And it looks so good. <laughs> so good morning, everyone. Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. It is snowing outside. I just noticed and I'm kind of freaking out that it's snowing. But anyways, I wanted to bring you guys along. I'm making breakfast right now. Truthfully, I don't feel like doing anything today, but your girl gotta do work. So she's gonna pull herself from her shoestrings, whatever the phrase is, and get to get to work. So I have been doing a couple of things. I've been investing and I kind of check that periodically throughout the day. I'm also applying for jobs. I am still quarantining. My last day is tomorrow and then I am going to work out. Not sure if I'm going to do a TikTok or not, but yeah, I just wanted to bring you guys along. I got a bunch of candles from Bath and Body Works. I always got them confused. You saw a couple of them. This is one that I bought beforehand but i bought the bigger version and apparently it's coming today hopefully they do come today i have this candle that is from target and i love to death i did make myself some coffee but then i decided to make some tea because it was freezing today and now i know why because it is snowing it's been a very lazy day today i don't know if i'm gonna do too much but i'm gonna try to show you guys as much as whole well. my cousin and i got the, the bath and body wear um sale each one was ten dollars these are all hers <laughs> and these are mine so if you're not a candle lover you can just skip this part but i just wanted to show you guys the ones that i got i got the sea salt and linen mahogany teakwood high intensity this is like one of my favorite ones i have the smaller version over there the black teakwood i got the lavender sea i believe this one is sparkling icicle i got this one before loved it burned it all <laughs> and i got a new one 
and then this last one which i'm so happy i got because i wasn't going to get this one but i saw it on my cousin's list and it literally smells like a christmas tree and then if for whatever reason you're curious as to know what candles my cousin got i will list them down below so that you guys can purchase them if you want to they're just an all-time good fave of mine i've been watching the british baking show for pretty much the whole day i'm going to work out and that's about it i don't feel like doing much today i think i'm gonna take it pretty slow Thursday actually my bad so I just wanted to show you guys this beauty so I think you guys saw the before I'm gonna try to get a clip of it but this looks so much better um it used to be so much more cluttered here because all my stuff was like jumbled up here it does rotate don't mind that <laughs> it does rotate and it's actually holds a lot of stuff which is great because i have a lot of product this isn't even like half of the stuff that i have i have stuff here and i also have stuff down there so but for the smaller stuff it's a great storage so good morning it is saturday and as you guys should know by now if you yeah, don't it's cleaning day i've actually been looking forward to this one because as you will see there is quite a mess in here i've just been like wrapping gifts and getting boxes and stuff so the mess has compiled unfortunately but yeah besides that i think i'm gonna take a walk today then i'm going to apply to some jobs i also have to prepare for an interview hopefully Today will be super productive. So I finished quarantine on Thursday, but I still have to get tested to make sure that I am negative, feel much, much better. And I just remember now that I have to call and try to make an appointment. So I'm gonna do that. So we're in a judge-free zone, but this is the state of the room. So I have a bunch of stuff here and um this needs to be cleaned up a little bit that needs to be sorted just slightly um the floor needs to be clean i have to throw that out and then my desk <laughs> i think out of everything usually my desk is the most messiest thing um that's because i just like pile everything there and then i figure it out um and then i just have like some clothes it's not too bad but like i wish i had a cleaner system so that i'm not like having to clean clean every week but it is what it is
rose clean I'm going to clean that up a little bit more but yeah my desk is pretty clear I cleaned my fan and my bed is done and my shelving there looks so much better and everything looks so much more organized and clean and I will throw those boxes away and those gifts will go in the Christmas tree my cousin actually got me the echo dot and it is fabulous for a speaker um and i used it today while i was cleaning and it's actually super loud so i have the top part of it but i don't have the bottom part um because i stored it but it's a personalized blender um and i just made a smoothie today and it was super good and 10 out of 10 i liked it um i'm gonna use it a couple more days to see how it works and then i got a couple presents that i have to wrap including this one as well so i finally cleaned now i'm just considering whether to buy coffee or to just make it buy a quick snack i'm not sure yet truthfully very lazy right now so i kind of just want to buy it but um i do want to edit this video so i can bring it out to you guys maybe apply to some jobs i'm not sure i did a little bit of like prep interview but uh i think i'll do more as the days go by so i'm actually waiting for my boyfriend to come over so that he can get me some coffee but um i just wanted to check in i'm gonna start editing now and i almost got emotional because i started watching my old videos from last year or this year but like in january and i wanted to see what my goals were for last year and like how well I did in terms of financial you know stuff as well and yeah I almost got emotional because I am in such a different place than what I was in a year ago and it is insane how much can change within a year like the fact that I am in good standing with my credit cards I'm paying off my student loans I'm almost done with my personal loans like it's just I'm financially stable like it's just I don't know it's insane so good morning happy Sunday I woke up today feeling like meal prepping so that's what I'm gonna do and I try to do these on Sundays because usually the rest of the week is pretty hectic and I don't really have the energy to meal prep, honestly. I'm going to be doing one of my HelloFresh meal packet things again. Um, I'm gonna do the chickpea one and then I'm gonna see if I, I will probably make a quick breakfast as well. And then I will get to work. everything on it and then these are just my to-go ones so this is not first impressions i just tasted it and it's so good i just wanted to show you guys it tastes like i went to chipotle and got a bowl but healthier i think the sauce and the chickpeas is what does it for me okay so i just watched the video with rowena she did this whole like list that you have to pick four life bucket values and kind of break them down and i just wanted to show you guys how much i wrote <laughs> But also, I just wanted to talk a little bit more about this because I think it's so important. And um, I'm going to link the video down below so that you guys can also watch it. Okay, so I just wanted to uh, talk a little bit more about the life buckets. So my four values in order of importance is personal growth, 
health and nutrition, work slash creativity, and then finance, surprise. <laughs> so I just wanted to talk about one of them so that you guys can get an idea of the prompt and how um, helpful it is. So I chose health and nutrition and the reason I chose health and nutrition is because I know how it feels like to be your healthiest self, to eat very nutritious foods, and also to just um, feel your best when you're working out. And at the end of 2019, I was feeling healthy, I was feeling my best, but I did not have a healthy relationship with food, not at all. I still viewed things like chocolate and junk food as bad, and um, veggies and fruits as good. And at the end of 2020, which is now, I'm really starting to look at food not as good or bad, but just different types of nutrition. And really when you're thinking about losing weight, it's more about a calorie deficit and moving your body. So going into 2021, what I'm really focusing on is being the healthiest version of myself really loving food for what it is and not looking at a certain food and thinking oh this is bad or oh this is good for me but just looking at it as food as something that is fueling my body and that's keeping me alive and yeah just having a better relationship and a better balance and just because i didn't say it before the other three pumps is how did you feel at the end of 2019? How did you feel at the end of 2020? And then the prompts for the other three questions is, um, how was your, like, if you chose health and nutrition, how was your health and nutrition at the end of 2019? How was your health and nutrition at the end of 2020? And then how do you want to improve that in 2021? And I really like it because it just puts you into perspective of the why in doing the things that you're doing but yeah i just wanted to put this out for you guys and also just for this vlog in general because this vlog is specifically about health and me trying to find the balance with health what is that? this is from my sister's boyfriend i also got him sweats but men always need socks if you ever need to get a guy something for christmas birthday whatever get them socks then these are just some things that i got for my boyfriend little trinkets i got him the, the hot sauce he's a fanatic of hot sauce i got him some poopery <laughs> and i got him this um condiment holder for your car and i think he'll love these <laughs> hello um i just wanted to show you guys i just got my girlfriend package and this is the mulberry by loma bra i think it's compressive like these ain't going anywhere and then um i love this like band because it's just again supportive like i wouldn't mind wearing this outside okay so this is the matching um set so these are the forest classic joggers and then this is the forest classic sweatshirt so i am in love this is my new set i want it in every color along with the bras um the only thing is i should have sized up just because the waistband when it gets to my hips is slightly tight i have to you know Zhuzh it a bit to get it over my hips, but then afterwards it fits perfectly. I I think that would be my only complaint. Like I wish the bands were like I wish there was an elastic, but it's fine. It's nothing crazy, and it's super comfortable. The material is amazing. Like like it feels like quality, and it's actually super warm as well. And I did my makeup today as well and put on some earrings, you know. Um, I have to go and fix my bed, make some coffee and some breakfast before I start work. But um, yeah, today I'm going to be vlogging. Yesterday I actually did quite a lot. I had to get tested. I had to go buy some pens and stuff. Yeah, today is supposed to snow. So hopefully it does snow because it has not snowed all. <laughs> Thank you.
Okay, so um, I just made a smoothie and I drank it and did not even realize it. Blueberries, raspberries, oat milk, uh, some cacao powder, hemp seed, chia seed, and honey. It was super good. And then I had an apple and some waffles. Some very delicious, very dark coffee. And now I'm gonna start doing some work. I have some emails to answer and then I have some other things that I have to do, but yeah. I've been doing some work I want to say for like an hour and a half maybe a little longer but now I'm going to do some data entry stuff um this is the majority of my day part of like my admin duties I'm going to keep chugging my coffee <laughs> and hopefully fi finish at a reasonable time but we will see <laughs> too you guys just saw i did some um gift wrapping and i also replanted like uh, hopefully for the last time i realized that her soil was not the correct soil it was soil for cactuses and um she was thriving but it was very slow uh, a little too slow and she just kept like wobbling too much and then i googled realized they need a different soil and they need a mix of those two so got the soil did gift wrapping i'm going to do some work because i need to finish up um some data entry that i've been dreading um this whole time but I'm so 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 happy that i'm finally getting that done and i'm going to probably do a workout, light up some candles. We might do some Christmas decorations downstairs. I'm not sure yet. And yeah, I also got Starbucks. I got the caramel brulee latte and that was basically my breakfast. And yesterday, yes, I did get Starbucks because I was helping my cousin finish her essay. So it's been a Starbucks heavy day. So I just wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I got from Vital Cost. I hope I'm saying their name right, but um, I love, love, love this place. I always get their stuff super quick and I never have issues. So, um, and they always have good deals and like percentages off and stuff, which is always great. So I got two chamomile with lavender teas. These are my forever favorites. Will I change it? Who knows? Um, and I got two wipes. The other one is like over there. I got these. Um, I compare them to like Starburst, but like 
semi healthier ones i got this big thing of honey it's kind of heavy because i like putting honey in my tea i got this oregano oil to actually drink because it says that it helps with like congestion and i have a lot of congestive issues does that make english sense i don't know but i have a lot of like um phlegm and stuff so i'm hoping this might help my lysine as for per usual <laughs> and then um i got three of these the other two are there and this is just the califia oat milk blend this one is the barista blend and it's by far my favorite um i think out of all the oat milks i've tried this one probably tops it and then i also got these cassava strip um sea salt i also wanted to show you guys because i got a couple of snacks <laughs> um because i'm a big snacker these are my fave 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 um snacks i don't even like coconut and they don't taste like coconut but they're so good so i got these popcorners that is connected to ojuelitas <laughs> um pretzels ridges i got this honey bunch of oats my tates gluten-free cookies and then my hippies as always being here i hope you guys um enjoyed once again health journey and i hope that you guys got some nuggets of information please let me know if anything resonated to you or if there's anything that you want to do for the new year for your health so important to have a better relationship with food and i hope that you will come on this journey with me so thank you guys for being here i love you guys so so much I'll see you in the next one. Adios.